and running. You don't want him to take too many hits like that. Oh, run. He throws. It's complete. Pro Wells makes the catch. He stopped at about the 29-yard line. He is a heck of a load to bring down. And with tempo, Duggan steps yeah. up, drops it off to Alana Lua. And Shea will hit right at the 30-yard line. Give him about six. He will go empty set. Five wide. Duggan quickly over the middle of the Pro Wells. And he makes that catch. Six-yard pickup. Pro Wells is back. He's at the top of your screen in the slot. Duggan keeping it. Running. Slides. Oh. Yes, Jordan Williams came flying in. Duggan keeps it. Left side. Cuts back. Dies. He's got the first down. Been this chess match with all the changing offensive, defensive fronts. Get back to it. Duggan, he's got a man. Wells open. Caught. Pro Wells makes the catch. But Wells brings this one in. We saw the big drop. Could have been a touchdown earlier in the game. Now, first and 10 for TCU. Opportunity to put more points on the board. Duggan steps up. He's going to keep it. Brought down at the 15. Us as athletes referred to heroes when we have veterans of this great country. Well said. First and 10. Duggan keeps it. Left side. First down. Brought down in midfield by Blake Lynch. How dangerous Max Duggan has been over these last few weeks carrying the football. But there it is right there. Mind as Baylor defense is rested. TCU. Their defense was on a long time. Duggan to the end zone. It's got a man. Fold. Out of bounds. Out of bounds. He didn't control it to the ground anyway. To Valence Hunt. That's, that's going to be close. Ball does get kicked out at the end. To Valence Hunt, the junior out of Jacksonville. Let's bring in our rules expert, Dean Blandino. Okay, Dino. Low snap. Duggan controls it. Steps up. Nearly set. Keeps it. Inside the 10. Breaks the tackle. Tiptoe. Dies for the end zone. Oh. Teach me how to Duggan. But just amazing there that he gets the... Mm. Tight rope, but that one right there, I think he was out. That's it's that second step.